Hey, so welcome to my garden. We have my hostas. And my DIY planters. And I just cut those plants into pieces. It was one plant. We'll see how they do in a week. I have snapdragons, zinnias, and sunflowers in my garden bed. I have pink lemonade blueberry. Uh, two raspberry plants. They, you only need to have one in order to actually get blooms. One suffering a bit. I have everbearing strawberries. I have French lavender, oregano and stevia, sweet mint, bee balm, French lavender, ah, spearmint, French lavender again, and rose thyme and lemon verbena thyme. This is mojito mint and lemon verbena for tea. Um, here's more snapdragons and at some point there will be living cucumbers in there, I hope. Um, the frost killed my last ones and the seeds haven't come up. I have some inside them and are plant out here. And out here I'm going to dig everything up and put some pumpkins, other squash, corn, and melons and the chickens are loving my compost I'm not loving it but they're having an excellent time over here uh, I planted these in March maybe April uh, we have all different kinds of beans bok choy and cabbage um, the runner beans on the back um, are a couple different kinds and I'll put that in a later journal entry and then I have bl the black beans and those are my transplants for in-ground planting and some impulse buys um, we have rosemary in the middle there and on either side is two types of sage and then we have dill um, and there should be basil on each side I bought another basil but I've had really bad luck with basil. They just keep dying. This is my tomato and pepper garden. I lost them all um, in the last frost. But this is a determinant, this little small um, plant. And the other one, I'm not sure what that one's going to be. But the rest are hybrids that I just picked up from Home Depot. And they're doing excellent. I don't expect any trouble from them. And then those are my onions.